Bishop Enstein Moki, teaching in the power of the Holy Spirit. Hello, God bless you, and thank you for being part of this video. Distance is not a barrier. Wherever you're watching from, God is the same yesterday, today, and forever. He's not limited by time. He's not limited by space. He cannot be limited by that device you're using, your mobile phone, your desktop computer. I want to answer a very, very important question that comes up very often in the body of Christ. We hear uh, believers all over the world asking is it important for me to speak in tongues most? I speak in tongues as a believer. Why? Because of different versions or different teachings that we have online in our different assemblies today about speaking in tongues, whereas the Bible is so clear about it. Now, let me put it in a different way. It's like asking if I should or must I do sport as a living thing. Well, if you want the benefit of speaking in tongues, you should. If one of the benefits of doing sport, being sportive, then you should get involved. <laughs> As a matter of fact, Jesus says to the disciples, As a sign of those who believe in me, they will speak in your tongues. Okay? They will speak in your tongues. So it comes to everyone that believes in the Lord Jesus Christ as a sign. Hallelujah. Now, Paul puts it when he was writing about the gift of the Holy Spirit. He says to some. You know, the gift of telling us that the Holy Spirit gives as he wills to some the gift of healing, to some the gift of, you know, word of knowledge, to some the gift of these, the gift of that, to some the gift of faith, to some the gift of prophecy, to some the gift of speaking in tongues. But Jesus already made us understand that speaking in tongues is something that comes to everyone that believes in him, speaking in new tongues. Is it important? Yes, it is important. Well, but you may not, you must not speak in tongues, except you want to benefit. The Bible says, Paul writing says, you communicate directly with God and you speak mysteries and your brain profited not. You do not understand whatever you are saying. There is no dictionary on earth that can explain the words that you you articulate when you speak in tongues. As a matter of fact, as a child of God who believes in Jesus, you already have that ability, that spiritual enablement to speak in tongues. All right. You already have it. Now, if you don't want to speak it, it is because you don't want to speak and because you don't um, uh, you want the benefit of it. You don't want the benefit of speaking in tongues. You don't want to confuse the devil. You don't want to speak mysteries. You don't want to edify yourself because the Bible says you edify. You you peel up yourself when you speak in a strange language, a strange tongue. It's a language that even the devil does not understand because the Bible says you speak to God alone. God alone understands through the Holy Spirit what you are saying. Now, the question that we should be asking ourselves is, how do I speak in tongues? Now, I will be uh, coming up with this in a different video, okay? You'll just find out here on my channel. You're going to have a video that I teach on how to speak in tongues. I know a lot of people are going to be talking about this, that it is God who teaches you how to speak in tongues. I want you to know that the Holy Spirit is a teacher and the Holy Spirit uses people to teach. Hallelujah. I don't teach tongues, but I teach how to speak. We don't teach a language. We teach how to speak a language because the language already exists. Okay, now you already have the ability because you are a believer in Jesus. Now I'm just going to, in a different video, teach you how to activate that and begin to speak in the language that you do not understand, that only God understands through the uh, articulation of the Holy Spirit. So the question again, as a believer, most I speak in tongues, well, if you want the benefit of speaking in tongues, then you should start speaking in tongues because as a believer, you already are able to speak in tongues. You don't just sit and, and sometimes, you know, people think they can just sit and, and the Holy Spirit will come over them and, in, you know, twisting their tongues and the, their mouth and they'll be speaking. I want you to know Paul says, I will, you know, it's, it's a will. They spoke, they that received the Holy Spirit. And as a matter of fact, Everyone that was in the upper room spoke in tongues. They spoke in these new tongues. 
Why? Because every believer should speak in tongues. That is nothing like, well, if God wants me to, I will. If it doesn't want me, I will not. He wants you to speak in your tongues. He wants you to speak so as to get tapped into the a long list of advantages that comes with speaking in that heavenly language. God wants you to right now as you are listening. He wants you to. And as I said in another video, I would teach you how to speak in tongues. And you say, you teach me and you know Holy Spirit. Well, the Holy Spirit is going to use me. And I'm going to activate that in you. You already have it. You just need to stir it up. Stir the gifts of tongues that is already in you. Everyone on the day of Pentecost that was in the room, upper room, spoke but not everyone prophesied not everyone taught except peter that is to tell you that there are other gifts that are given to people according to the will of the holy spirit but the gift of speaking in tongues is for every believer every child of god you can just receive and keep it it's like you have a gift from someone and you decide to just go and keep it somewhere you're not making use of it it's up to you it's up to you but if you want the benefits of it you should be speaking in tongues. You should be speaking in tongues. Now, I look forward to seeing you in the video, How to Speak in Tongues. God bless you as you watch this. Thank you and bye-bye. We hope you were richly blessed by these teachings of our man of God. Kindly subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell so that you get notified each time we upload a new video. God bless you.